And what did you see on that last play too? Um, it looked like he had the open lane to the hoop and then Drew kind of cut you off there. Did you even see him in your line of vision on the way to the hoop? No, I didn't see him. It wasn't, um, the play was actually, JT was supposed to come up and get it, but everybody was just standing around. Um, and, you know, we had no timeouts and it was a five second count on the way. So, you know, I just got open, tried to make a play. Drew did a good job of, you know, helping. Um, and that's it, made a good play. Marcus, up 14 with 10 minutes to go. Um, did the team's mentality change a little bit? Was there kind of part of the cliche, like playing not to lose versus playing to win the game? No, I don't think so. You know, I just think we just didn't do what we were supposed to do. You know, the mentality was there to go win a game, you know, and uh, we just fell up short. We didn't execute, like I said, when we were supposed to, when it mattered the most, they did. Uh, Marcus, just uh, the final 14 seconds, what, what, what was the emotion after the game like in the locker room? You've been through a lot with this uh, team. Uh, how stunned were you guys, frustrated? What's your feeling as you sat there and now look ahead to bounce back? Oh, we were hot. We're hot, you know, just because we, we, we know we did it to ourselves. Nobody else, you know, we take the blame. But now, see, we got to turn around and go right back at it. We ain't got time to soak. We ain't got time to put our heads down. It is what it is. On to the next one. Marcus, it seemed like the defending champions made championship plays. Is there something you can take from that? I mean, obviously, they're a team like you're a team. You've got to knock them out. You can't cruise. I mean, what kind of lessons can you take from this? A lot of them. The main one, offensive rebound. We box out. We win that game. You know, and that's what it ultimately comes down to. They, they did a good job of getting um, their team uh, extra shots. And, and, and they hit them, and, and they made us pay. So got to do a better job on that end and clean that up, and, you know, and that's just what it is. Like I said, like you said, they're the defending champs. They made some championship plays, and now we got to respond. Mark, you mentioned, like, on to the next one. You guys have done a good job over these past few months of bouncing back and not having any long, like, losing streaks and, and finding a way. How, how do you do that after losing in this fashion when everything's feeling good, you're at home, you feel like you're just kind of on the edge there? How do you how do you move on so quickly? Just move on. They did to us what we did to them the last game at their place, so we just got to come back out and keep swinging. You know, we got to fight back, and that's just what it is. We don't have time to worry about how we lost. We ain't got time to worry about uh, we lost and right now, and it hurts. Got time for that, so... It hurts. It definitely hurts, but we ain't got time to feel it. We got to go on to the next one, and, and really it's simple. If you're not ready to come play the next game, then don't step on that court. So that's how you get ready and move on.